the rookie Tyler Algier drafted in round five, a 151st pick from BYU. Thoughts on Tyler Algier? Algier's a guy I've been able to pick up a ton of shares of in rookie yep. drafts. Ton of shares of in rookie drafts. Um, anywhere from mid to late second round, I think in one draft, I was able to get him in the third mm-hmm. just because of everybody was going so wide receiver heavy. So he's a guy I'm taking a ton of flyers on. They don't have youth at that position between Damian Williams and Cordell Patterson. So in dynasty situations, there is a clear path to opportunity. We'll see what comes from that. But again, some of that is all you can ask for, right? Give the Is the guy going to have a chance? He's going to have a chance in this offense. So therefore, I'm drafting him. I think by the time redraft season comes along, he's going to be going higher than Damian Williams, which doesn't necessarily hurt my feelings, right? Like that, that does tend to happen. So I will be testing the waters, if you will, come redrafts to see if I'm going to fill him in on my roster in the, you know, ninth or 10th round. But um, the kid has a lot of power. He has a lot of strength coming out of BYU. Um, He doesn't have a whole lot of wear and tear on him. Um, All things considered, they don't really hit hard in the Pac-12 anyway. Yes, I just said it. (laughs) Um, So I'm not too much worried about, you know, the the usage in, in college. So I will be interestingly awaiting more up-to-date redraft ADP numbers to try and figure out if this is a guy that I'm going to take a chance on or not. But in Dynasty rookie drafts, I am all over this guy. I have him in a ton of different places. A lot of it's just because that's how the board felt me. You know, go wide receiver in the first round, was able to pick him up in the second round to kind of pair that out and and continue to build my Dynasty rosters. Um, so we're we're gonna see what the kid does, but he has he has the ability to be a very serviceable running back in the NFL. And I think that's really where you see the the first and second down kind of running work end up going is more in Tyler Algier's way. And again, them using Cordell Patterson as more of a receiving option there. Uh, so I like it. I'm going to be in. On, I'm definitely in on him in rookie drafts, very much to the same point you just said, right? I think that he provides you a ton of value in the in the mid to late second. And I've gotten him in the as early as the third as well, uh, or in the early thirds there as well, a couple of different places, as well as the fact that for you know most of um, redraft leagues right now, he'll be going undrafted in most of those. Um, but he's a guy that, you know, if he's still on the board in the last round of my rookie or last round of my redraft league, I'm going to throw the dart there and just see if it sticks. 